information it can be a high as well it can be kind of a bus for people something to occupy almost a form of entertainment uh, as well and, and beyond that of course we have uh, all truths are not going to be documented and vice versa just because something is documented doesn't mean it's the the, the truth there either things can be forged and, and and fake and what have you so i think you're right david uh, you have to walk your own path follow your own heart and, and at the end of the day no one else can tell you what that true path is you know it has to be up to you and it has to be up to to everybody out there and and, and just as long as people do that i, I don't see any any problems with that or, or reason to complain even on anybody else they're free to choose as they as they go about their lives so. Yeah, well, there's a couple of things about that, Henrik. Uh, first of all, um, you're, you're, you're right in, in, in this sense about the way people are treating some of this information, and, or many people are treating some of this information. And that is, it's like, it's like a hobby, in, in, in a sense. It's an add-on to your life. And you go onto forums, and, and, and um, I'm not saying that you know, having a go of forums. There's a lot of good information that's uh, uh, exchanged. But you go onto forums, and you can you can say this and say that. Oh no, I think this. Oh no, you're an idiot. I know more than you, and all this stuff. And and you can read the information. And if that's as far as it goes, then all we are doing is instead of having the prison built around us without us seeing it. Now we're seeing it, and it, it, instead of uh, just ignoring it because uh, it, it couldn't be happening, now we're saying, "Oh look, see what they're doing now. I bet they do this next, and I, uh, all this stuff." But that's just fine. It's a step forward. We've mm. seen it. Mm. The question is, then, what do we do about it? You know, it, 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 it just sitting sitting on, on on a forum exchanging views on a on a thing every day is, is that as much as we're going to do, or are we going to get involved? Has it stopped going to be a, a hobby? And start to be the focus of our um, lives because we're we're at a point now where this uh, control system has moved on to the point where it is really impacting on the most basic human freedoms, and it's on the cusp in many areas, not least economic, where it wants to push um, beyond that into into the realms that we've been talking about all these years of the global fascist dictatorship mm. now we've moved on greatly like i say because so many more people can see it at least levels of it um but uh to uh to just watch it and, and commentate on it and, and and watch our oh look they put another bar up there oh go another bar in there come on look ethel <laughs> i mean come on we, we, we we've got to do more than that yeah. um, and another thing we we need to do which comes from the point you were making henrik is if we are going to understand what we're dealing with um, and what is actually happening around us, we have got to suspend the limitations of what we perceive as possible. We, we need to um, appreciate that humanity in this period that we call known human history has been in an incredibly suppressed state mentally um, and in ways that are just beyond what most people would, would think was possible. Uh, but because we've been in that suppressed state, what we perceive to be the cutting edge of possibility is not, stands back in amazement, uh, the cutting edge of possibility. And if we are going to make judgments on what is happening on the basis of what we believe is possible, i.e. the cutting edge of human uh, possibility in the public arena is where the cutting edge is, mm. then we are going to get nowhere, nowhere near what is actually happening. 